I was planning to do this recording uh, uh, on, on Sunday, but uh, yeah, I I would have wanted to do it on Sunday, I guess. Well, I, I hold a ritual every year at this point that uh, at Denny's at breakfast. Uh, 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 sorry, breakfast at Denny's. Uh, anyway, because, uh, yeah. Pretty much to mourn my mom's passing. Because, uh, yeah. Yeah, that god awful house. And the worst part is when I got, I suffered some serious setbacks over the last few months because of that corrupt ex-landlord of mine. Ah, oh, God. I wish I could get through. Think us. It's going to be five years since my mom would have been left in that left in house and. Yeah, yeah, that, that that means back taxes, the back taxes thing is going to be a pain. I I, I don't know what to do about that, but <sighs> I mean, uh, hopefully the pandemic, uh, hopefully the pandemic causes a delay in, in handling the back taxes because I swear to God, like, why do people want to be so stubborn anyway? Like. I mean, God knows I'm, God knows I'm benefiting more than I should from disasters. Like, I, I, I have so much. Com I, I, I can say something about the Russia-Ukraine war right, at this point. I mean, I mean, the good news is um, that it looks like Ukraine is pushing back Russia. Thank God. Yeah, yeah, I, I just put my all my thoughts about this whole mess into a text document. Yeah, it's going to come with the mm, patches with patches for Game Boy War 3 because I have updated them again. I mean, I should cite that I have done a practice run on, of, of this. I managed no casualties, but it took 24 days, so yeah. I mean, this this map was worse than base Game Boy War 3, as you're going to see. Anyway, yeah, let, let's get started, because this is on the new, this is on the upcoming new master patch for, for my Game Boy War 3 mm, patches. This is standard map 7, and which is called Sea Maze, because of character limit, otherwise I would be calling it Sea Labyrinth, because, uh, yeah. Yeah, I would prefer to involve Wordic Day in Bowman. Uh, yeah. Anyway, as you can see, uh, Sea Maze it involves plenty of Navy. Uh, oh, right. I should, I should turn on the... Mm. Default speakers. Yeah, sorry about that. I had them off because I wanted to avoid echo from my Twitch stream. Because... Anyway, let's get started. Let's start, side start with 3,000 gold apiece and plenty of materials. Not, not uh, although. Mm, Although, even if we started with 50 materials, well, well, you'll see soon enough. There's a lot of neutral properties to scramble over, so yeah. Let's get this show on the road. Uh, day one. Now, there's not much to work with. Pilgrims from both locations, and yeah, that's the auto intern mm, patching effect. 
It, it ends your turn when the key... When it deems you unable to move any further. Anyway... We kind of need more materials. Uh, oh! You might notice that, yeah, the ex experience bar is there. Oh. And the HP display patch is also bad. Also improved. A few bug fixes are addressed. Not all of them, though. Sadly. There's only so much I can do. But anyway, it's time to get to starting the capturing stuff. But you may be wondering why I'm capturing this harbor. I mean, the only thing the harbor does is stuff related to sea units, and uh, all it does is provide gold, which we can get just fine from the airport and the factories. And <laughs> yeah, yeah, that that's. That's one of the new additions in version 2.0 of the Hellbound patch. Harbors now provide materials. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I'm capturing both harbors off the bat. I mean, they, you can't produce work cars off of them, but... work cars early enough. <laughs> you can have them develop the harbors. They'll pro the harbors will provide some provide some income, etc, etc. <laughs> and the computer is an idiot. It deployed a work car on day one and it had the work car to... Uh, yeah. <laughs> the computer sucks. Yeah. The, uh, harbor caps are, are a bit of a compromise if, if you care about head count. But, uh, yeah. Take the city. Because I actually want to grab this stuff early enough. decision with the capture phase. Do you capture harbors and lose head, lose head count, or do you capture factories and lose schools, or do you capture cities and lose materials, or airports and lose... I mean, yeah, yeah, it makes the game more methodical, to say the least. I mean, war cars are not even going to recover materials from harbors, remember. And, and yeah, the game... The game sees that we can still build a tanker, but... Uh, we don't want to build one, and de definitely not from there, because sea units are slow. Computer gets a harbor. <laughs> Computer opts to get. Yeah, well, the the the, yeah, the computer has not been updated. I I will be fair in, in that regard. But gosh.
Because there's actually a there's actually a collection of properties to the east right over here and things are going to get interesting over there Just... well because I... the thing is if I capture the city first I get more money but uh... I mean if I capture the airport first I have a refueling point for the trend for, for the transport helicopter. But if I capture the factory first, I can deploy a work car. Or if I capture the harbor first, I can get more income. Or better income at the case, maybe. So, really, more choices. Uh, yeah, you see I'm building work cars early. Because the, the computer has some problems with... has some problems with its movement. Uh, yeah. uh, I should also mention that... It, in version 2.0, factories now also now also can deploy from anywhere, regardless of proximity to your capital. That thing. Nothing. It's just a four percent worker unit. Get this other harbor. Then yeah, the announcement calls it a die, but yeah. Yeah, uh, since I'm... Dang it. This is going to be... This is going to be fun. Building up the headquarters. Because I'd rather build up more gold. Yeah, that's... That's a good thing about Harbors providing materials now, because, uh, because you can focus the work cars on having them build up, uh, build up your money supply, uh, they'll pay for themselves uh, significantly faster in terms of materials, or rather more casually, and you can focus, and yeah, like I say, you can focus on your money supply, I mean, uh, um, building up Harper's first does have its drawbacks, but...
I'll worry about that, Norton. You keep doing that. They're building up their material. I mean, then it's a Game Boy Color. What do I expect from... ...from the computer, but... <laughs> they built an APC. Uh, sir? I'm gonna build up this harbor. Transport helicopter, thankfully. I don't think I'll have enough for a transport helicopter in the next turn. It's a good thing that our I had I added harbor deployment from anywhere uh, in version 1.0 because uh, yeah I could build units from here and could build units from here or actually I can build the unit from here and start sieging away. The only problem is I'll be close to the enemy forces, but. I don't think it matters too much. But it could help to get some of this stuff out of the way. This airport. to go this way and another to get this harbor. I would want to make sure that the current getting this harbor would not get pinned or anything. How much do I how much can I spare? Oh, the heck. Yeah, it's a little risky to deploy another work car, but with me. I don't have enough money to afford an Aegis Warship on the next turn anyway. and Humvee on a map like this. Yeah, okay, sure. You do that. 
Either you, computer. Now here's another change I did in version 2.0. Yeah. Uh, yeah. The, a unit moving off of a transporter that already finished its own turn. Yeah. Yeah, their movement power is cut in half, although it's rounded up, so the grunts have two movement power, etc, etc. Not that it matters too much here. It does limit my property choice a bit, but nothing too bad. Capturing the factory because I'd rather have to work hard out ASAP. I mean, oh, I could have the ages before shipping. For, to see what White Moon will deploy to cause problems. <sighs> Dang it! I... Looks like I forgot that I have already fully developed. Huh. develop this harbor. Yeah, let's take care of that before that's too big a problem. Property experience. I actually have the property experience in 2.0 because it was just too slow. It, it, it's also up to even further for C and it's this was well they now get 2.5 times what they originally got. Other units simply get two times what they got before. So yeah, yeah. C and it's getting more property experience is because a scene it of course can not go on to a property better than harbors and harbors and harbors yeah well they're deployment point so yeah
I mean, I'm gonna want to fight a regular fighter, but uh. I work hard there so that I can develop properties and develop that entire cluster. I wonder I can go ahead and do the second work hard there on the next day. Because the next day... And I'm putting this transport helicopter away, pretty much. It'll be a while before I get any native mileage out of it. For now. Transport helicopter under control. The computer will eventually build anti-air units, including the anti-air missile launcher. And I should mention that the, the planes are now more vulnerable to range fire than, than before. Helicopters are less vulnerable, by the way. But... Highlander. <laughs> I mean, yeah, Highlander. Did you know that <laughs> fighters can in two range, two range air units now? No. <laughs> Sorry, you're not hitting my guy anytime soon. Warship. Start rampaging with our battleship one of the Now I should point out something. to get the, in the Aegis Warship's primary weapon, 25 light land attack, that, against a flood of units that are light land, and such as what we're going to be experiencing, yeah, that's going to be touchy, especially with the limited ammo. Right. Get these properties. Yes, the 
and forget about it. I'm just trying to get money. <laughs> they they placed the anti-air missile hunter in a stupid location, like or not the anti-air missile hunter, the transport helicopter. Up there. Oh. oh wow, you actually shot up my You would! Fifty thing. I mean, at least the harbor's fully developed. But... I'm pretty sure of it, if it was anyway. APC got loaded on the... Both of the APCs got loaded on the lander. I don't think he wants to chase. I don't mind giving up a little time. Of course, range virus. I'm trying to be impressive, but. <laughs> Dang it! problem with it. <sighs> I need some defenses real quick. <sighs> Dang! Because that he just because that lander's going to be a problem. Some HP to the, so that it would get healed off. I mean, that, that's going to be annoying, and it slows down my combat capability. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Yeah. The, the big problem is when. Hold up. Problem is when the battleship won't deal much damage to lightning units. Hmm. Maybe a rocket launcher or two could 
fix things. Oh, that's another thing I did. I reduced the price tags on the on the indirects because the artillery because the artillery now deals less damage, which actually complicates things with practice with class three. Uh, but, uh, don't worry, I have a text document for class three. Oh, oh, and you might notice that I actually gave the indirects all three indirects their own rifles. But uh, take a look at the ammo counts. Three, three, three. In addition. The focus loss of the uh, units are so high. Well, I mean, it's not that high with the end launcher, but. Five for the rocket launcher. Four for the end here missile launcher. And six for the artillery. Because, yeah, I don't want them having any way to snipe off air units. <laughs> oh, they need to be. They should stay vulnerable to air units. Right. Computer went to the top. You get out of here. Can I snipe off that? I think that's can I? I mean, I could, but the problem is that the bazooka guy will get control of the harbor. That'll cause problems. I mean, at least I'll be able to one-shot the, the bazookas. Sure. Mostly, I just have to worry about landers being scummy. I should get the transporting guys. Stand by for the orders. I mean, I would build. I would want to build a transport plane, but uh, things have to wait and get here now. All this.
yeah, not much I can do right now. And the rocket launchers do something to it, but the problem is it. Is that, I mean, yeah, like enemies are going to move close to the close to my way. I try to reach for the MB tank. Because the MB tank's going to reach it with all the important stuff. And there's a nice little feature with the tanker as well that's going to help the MB tank. Oh, and yeah, this city can be deployed because it's within five spaces of the, of the capital. So can this city. Uh, yeah, yeah, this city already. He was able to play, but we didn't free space. Anyway, I would want to get the foot soldiers down here. Get one of the foot soldiers down here. After this stuff. I mean, I would want to keep the enemy from doing too much. But still. On board. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god, they built a lander! Five, three, two, three, four, five. The good news is they don't end. Goodness is they don't add the anti-air missile launcher out. The bad news is they they can always deploy something to be a not to keep being obnoxious regardless. Oh, there we go. Hit this thing. Gosh, they have the lander out regardless. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, helicopters now benefit from the rain, but in the first place... The cover value floors at 20, so helicopters will get no more, no more benefit from playing for well anything with 20 or less cover than they would roads. Mountains are in that sense effectively plus 40 cover, and yeah, speaking of mountains, yeah, I actually improved their cover value to 60. Capital val Capital's cover value has been nerfed to 50 from 70. Because, yeah, I kind of didn't make sense for, for helicopters to be able to hide better behind uh, in capital buildings than they could behind, uh, behind mountain peaks. That's annoying. Seventy. 
I feel only one damage. That's not worth it. But this is... Getting rid of you. Goodbye. enough money for another easy force ship. Unfortunately, the grunt will have to wait before he can do anything any time soon. <laughs> yeah, I know, it's kind of weird to do that, to build a submarine, but I... Yeah, I'm building a tanker there. I'm building the tanker there, too. So. I mean, you might think it weird to build a tanker, but... Actually, it's not that weird right now, but... Still... Submarine because I oh, oh the thing is shading nice. I don't know why the tanker needs to retreat though. If it's heading to the harbor just to the just to the east of White Moon's capital it's kinda silly. This is harbor soon. I mean, the computer did not think to deploy anything from there. Dang it! It's going to be so annoying. I mean, it's a good thing that the that I gave the tinker the the lander m movement type. Still. You in particular are a pet. Yeah, because yeah, anything with anti armor is going to be capable of damaging. Units. Get out of here. Oh, no air units? No anti air units yet?
Come on. Landing operation. Actually, 6400. And materials is not going to be a problem. The only issue is going to be. Uh, what was it? Yeah, there's a weak spot, more or less. Hmm. I would want a rocket launcher. A main battle tank. And an artillery. <sighs> Dang it, I can't afford it. Later. That, that's okay, though. Probably soon enough. Nothing else I want to do there. <laughs> I don't know what the lander's thinking. <laughs> sea units are slow. Why? You want to move that way? Gosh. Bazookas uh, are creeping along. That's going to be fun. Uh, you would! You would! <laughs> Whatever. Hi! Submarine Can I, like, can I like 
focus on the KO. Thank heaven. Yes. Because the Humvee's blocking the way for the t blocking the tanker from uh, up. thing out of play because it's going to be particularly obnoxious. I know I reduced the price tag on the play thing, but... Aircraft carrier. I'll have to delay my landing operations by a day. aircraft carrier. The enemy has not built any. Uh, any what's it? <laughs> Dang it! My helicopter's getting beaten up. Yeah. 
you don't cross shoals. going to be fun. Big issue is that the, <laughs> the submarine's going to lose a lot of attack power, so that's going to be obnoxious. I know that the rocket launcher is supposed to be anti anti what's it anti lightning and not anti armor. Yeah, compromise. This is fun. So annoying. Ah, oh, no. I don't have to. Yeah, I'm going to have to come from right there. But I'd rather block the sub. Didn't let the. What do you have any. Okay, just a grunt. That was not very good. Warship's going to get hit hard. That submarine's going to be a pain. Ah, and it's. Mm. Build the top of it. 
and I should get this work on with the factory soon enough too, so... Yeah, what a compromising turn this is. Because the submarine kid at the Aegis warship, then he... Uh, Okay, the submarine just it's like guy on the on the harbor and for only three damage, which is going to get healed up. <laughs> Simultaneous strike at least, but gosh! That stings! Oh my god! There's the end here unit. You need to go. Something that's been added to the lander, too. Soon enough. you on the aircraft carrier anyway. You too, because... With that anti-air missile out and about, it's going to be a problem to get, get anything done with air units without getting them wet. Without them getting shot out of the sky. That APC. Anyway, so... I should have to set up a sufficient landing operation and everything. That's the what that's the uh, yeah you'll see soon enough. Uh, 
Oh, perfect! Yeah, and here, Miss Launcher. Wait, actually. Oh, and yeah, you saw correctly. The aircraft carrier carrier got yield because it was right next to the tanker. That's another new feature in version 2.0. In case you didn't see the video. Ah, dang it! The, there's an anti-air tank now. You want something? No, you don't. Dang it! That's annoying. Convenient. Miner will get here soon enough, and then, and then the units can start rampaging, and the Humvee's going to get resisted. Missile launcher is also too far away from the bottom. Too far away. Men are just too far away. Anyway, yeah. Yeah. Silly AI is si Oh my god, and I just realized what the <laughs> Oh Oh wow. I can just grab this harbor real quick. I think the lander doesn't do anything about the...
perhaps unsurprisingly that thing lives. That Humvee's out of the picture now. You're next! Oh my. We'll find out anything that could cause the artillery problems though. But just to be safe, I'll keep it on the forest. Now I see the end here. I mean, yeah, well, the... Mm -mm. Oh, and that's another touch. I mean, the large aircraft carrier would be better in this position, but yeah, I'm using the smaller aircraft carrier. Cosla, Cosla, coming up in by North Alpha. Regardless, you coming out? No, I'm gonna come. Ah, dang it! <laughs> And yeah, I have a land force coming in so that they, so they can start working on working on munching these things up. Wait, why did I, why did the nines not show up? Oh my really <sighs> My goodness. I I don't know. Uh, uh, Then donate to me the 
plate. You're going to need. Oh, you want to do that? But yeah, you go ahead. Give give my gunship some experience. Oh, some experience. oh okay, good. That that was concerning. Go away! Oh, hi there! on the small aircraft carrier do get property experience. Hi there. Good time for the Yeah, I'm getting rid of you. Oh, so you'd be left with 5 HP. Good enough! I mean, granted, the submarine has to be placed here, but... this guy around. I should get this... Mm.
work on these two things. Sniper's up. I think I should get rid of this bazooka soldier. Yeah. There will be enough problems with the Freaking holy hunters. <laughs> Seriously, isn't that silly? Seriously, the thing that the base game doesn't even have mm, mm, battleship pseudo or otherwise. Ah, dang it! I need a supply truck. That, that's annoying. I should mention that the helicopters have some flight resistance to green fire. Just, but don't expect results. I check one go.
Go away. You go bye bye. Out of here. Beating you. I really should buy some aircraft carriers. Hi, you're... Ah, oh, come on. You're gone. Oh yeah, and planes. 
also lose some of their fabric and other things. I have no money. Where's the lander? Oh, there it is. <laughs> the submarine one shuts it, and I get to level up too, so. Enemy force no longer has any. What's it? this. Punches through the HQ defense. A rank two. Another new feature on the tanker is that it heals land units as well. So it's a supply track actually. Build this lander. Hefty light lane. Light lane units.
still in good shape. I'm in an area where I can't do anything. That's annoying. There's not going to be any more armor units, I'm pretty sure. May as well get this EP stuff. Not that it's going to matter too much. Shots work hard from three spaces away. That's nice. That's a nice if it's know what I was thinking giving uh, the just worship the primary weapon of uh, only twenty five hold up eighteen thirty six uh, yeah twenty five not too high but it's not too Okay, so look over the sets. Look at that, 9,800 old income. And completion day is 22. But yeah, this map would be so much worse. In It's so, still so much better in Pal Bell Game Boy World 3. I mean, don't get me wrong. It, there's still the lack of a, a tech combat navy. There's still, uh, what was it? Or not in tech in combat. <laughs> the non tech combat navy. Like, like Day the Bruins Gunboat or Custom Wars Hovercraft. But, yeah, you still see the marked improvement. There's an, there's an actual battleship. I mean, granted, that's because of the Aegis warship is made into a battleship of sorts. Yeah. What else? Oh, yeah. And units cost so much less. Also, yeah. I, I think, how, yeah, I was. I'm, materials are not a problem on naval maps anymore. There, there's a thing of the past, as you can see. Hmm. 
good. Developing armors. Y you can just focus on getting gold and done with it. I mean, granted, you may want to build a factory, so the... Well, maybe not. You'd still want to get gold where you can, but... Building up harbors also helps. I mean, it speeds it things so much. But anyway. Yeah, let's finish this. And as we can determine, this is a no casualties one. Two days, 38 units built with no units lost. Oh, and by the way, Game Boy War 3 count units lost by joins and onto the lost counter. Because, yeah. Gold's a lot. Materials is a lot, definitely. Why would we lost? 67 units and lost power, but gold is 821, materials 706. Uh, yeah. Maybe still sketchy in Game Boy War 3, but yeah, you can see the improvements to say the least. But yeah, that just about covers. Thank you, everybody.